tomorrow morning, SpaceX will try again to launch satellites into space from our space coast. News 6's James Barbero is in Brevard County with a closer look at the mission. When you wake up tomorrow, SpaceX might make your weekend extra special with the latest mission launching Starlink satellites. For 14 months, Elon Musk's efforts to build a satellite constellation orbiting Earth by the thousands has successfully deployed nine rounds of Starlinks. At 10.54 in the morning tomorrow, the 10th mission will bring the satellite total close to 600. Ten's a big milestone. Space photographer Dr. Ken Kramer will be watching. Space fans worldwide have been waiting for weeks because this mission was delayed a few times, mostly because of the weather. Conditions are 60% favorable tomorrow. A live view as it was deploying. While a big number, 600 of these internet providing satellites is still more than 100 shy of when they begin minimal service. Dr. Kramer says when SpaceX puts over a thousand of these satellites in orbit, then they're expected to reach full service in the U.S. You might be contacted by SpaceX to participate, you know, if you're in one of those rural areas. So it's a big number, it's a big deal, a lot of satellites start a beta testing, and that means they're really moving and they will move on from that point to full service early, early next year probably. If the launch happens tomorrow morning at 1054, we will bring it to you live on ClickOrlando.com. At NASA's Kennedy Space Center, I'm James Sparvero, getting results news 6. There is now an easy way to get caught up on what's going on with SpaceX, NASA astronauts, and missions. We have launched our first ever space newsletter. It comes out every Wednesday afternoon and has all the latest space news. Just head to clickorlando.com and sign up for free. And while you're there, check out our other News 6 newsletters.